Oh, ladies and gentlemen, it is I, Hidden Flame, and welcome back to another episode of Star Trek Online. Now, you guys may not know this, but I record in bulk. And on the last, or one of the last episodes I have done, it was done out of order by mistake. I fixed that situation in post, but... It said we were going into Season 2, which is wrong. I looked back. This will be Season 5. Season 4 was a short one, but there was a reason for that, and you probably saw it. So, I do apologize for all the issues. And I did a quick retrofit. We got a new skin. We have a look changed. And this is the official USS Petra 92961-8. We have done a bunch of retrofitting of the the ship in itself. So what I have done, what I have done, I went through and readjusted all of my stuff here. Oops, we are missing something. What are we missing? Wow, okay, I don't have anything there. I must have ran out of things. But anyway, let us continue. I think Janeway needs us. A group of Talaxians living in the Intaba system are ready to move to a new homeworld. Admiral Tuvok and Voyager have gone ahead to begin preparations, and I'd like you to assist them. Yes, Admiral, we will go. There's something interesting I'd like And away we go. So yes, we have done the retrofit, and we have increased our abilities, we have increased our powers, traits, skills, all of that has been... Oh, apparently I've missed a few things. So I guess I will hit this, this, and this. Ooh, what's these? Uh... Sure, why not? All these are passive, I think. Yeah, besides rock and roll, everything's passive. Which is fine. Let's go in. We have arrived at the Intaba system, sir. Our orders are to rendezvous with Admiral Tuvok on Voyager, setting a course for the coordinates now. Uh oh, we got Kazon. Voyager is under attack by the Kazon. Engines are offline. Requesting assistance. Oh dear, these K's on are rough, aren't they? Okay, you want to be that way? One down. Sure. 
Jeez, these guys are so... There we go. These guys are rough and fast. Where's the Voyager? Where's Voyager? Is that it down there? Thank you for your assistance. This base is populated by Talaxians. My shipmate from Voyager, Neelix, joined them before they moved to this location. The Talaxians have been looking for a new homeworld for quite some time, and now they have found one. I miss what he said. History that the relocation of the Romulans will be invaluable in this process. Uh, do you need a repair there, guys? Guess not. Admiral Janeway. She was promoted some time ago. Admiral Janeway? Of course. She certainly earned that promotion. My link to the Alpha Quadrant wasn't as strong as I wanted it to be until the Janolan Dyson Sphere opened a path straight to the Delta Quadrant. Now we get all sorts of news, but yours is the first ship to visit. I, uh, I may make a trip to Earth myself sometime, sample the cuisine, but that will have to wait until after the colonization. I barely have a minute to myself anymore. There's just so much to do. About that. I'm afraid the Federation appreciates your efforts on its behalf, but could we get back to the colonization efforts, please? Oh, where are my manners? You must be tired and thirsty after your long journey. Come to the colony. We'll fix you right up. But, but, but if I could impose on you just for a small favor first, the case on this trip has been giving us a lot of trouble lately. We've constructed some shield generators to protect the base, but the case on keep knocking them offline and all my shuttles are prepping for could you reactivate the shields for us? Of course, Neelix. Wonderful. Just fly to the generators and start the relaunch sequence. It will take them a few minutes to get up to full strength, but that shouldn't be a problem. After that, beam down to the colony. I'll start making some nicely old root stew for you. Restart the shield generators. Got it. Repair is complete. The satellite received only minimum damage. Mysterious passenger. Okay. I can't go full impulse. If I go full impulse, I am flying to the other side of the map. Repairs are complete. The case on managed to to short out the EPS conduits. I was able to reroute power through secondary relays. That's why you are our in chief engineer. There's six.
Uh, that completes all of the satellite repairs, sir. Uh, shielding systems coming back online now. Thank you so much for your assistance. You may beam down to our base at your leisure. Oh, and speaking in my formal capacity as permanent ambassador, welcome to the Delta Quadrant. Thank you, Neelix. So good to meet you in person. View screens are so impersonal, don't you think? May I shake your hand? I if memory serves, that's how. Mr. Vulcan? Is that you, Tuvok? Indeed. It is agreeable to see you again, Neelix. What a wonderful surprise. C come, my friends, we have so much to discuss. Mr. Vulcan? <laughs> You look well, Neelix. As do you. Family, children. Being here has changed me for the better. Wish I knew how to walk. Indeed. This colony is an improvement on your previous home. Twice as large and completely updated. You should see the kitchen. But you still seek a new homeworld? Of course, children need sun and open skies. A place to put down roots. What was that? Sir, the Kazon returned almost as soon as he transported down. We drove them off, but they got a lucky shot in at the base before they left. Senses are showing some structural damage in Operations Bay. Acknowledge. Inform me if the Kazon returned. The Operations Bay? Dexter was in there. Who's Dexter? Dex is a little dizzy, but she'll be fine. I, I have to stay with her, though. I'm afraid I must impose on your kindness again. Several of our systems were damaged in the attack, and I can't help fix them just now. Of course, Neelix. I'll help. What can I do? Several of our systems are malfunctioning. Our communications, environmental controls, engineering, and the controls for the crane loading our ships all have been damaged. It would be my pleasure. I think I'm a Vulcan or I would strangle Neelix. I didn't mind him as a character, but he's kind of annoying after a while. Okay, power. Uh, first problem seems to be the console's power. Reroute. The console is now has an issue with the electric plasma flow. The isolinear chip matrix is causing several problems or errors. And I'm fairly certain the remaining problem is with the console. There we go. Oh, must be glass or something there. Am 
Am I going up? Yes, I am. Uh Okay. So what have I missed? Huh, oh, okay. There we are. Okay, the optimal range for the frequency for this module communications array is 8.4 terahertz. Frequency output can be adjusted. Okay, increase. Close enough. Can I jump out the window? No? Okay. Thank you so much. Everything seems to be working properly now, and Dex is feeling much better. Is it your wife? Take one final lap around the base and speak to a few people before we depart. Would you care to accompany me? Certainly. Oh, so you're going to be accompanying me. I see how this is. preparing the most wonderful feast to celebrate the colonization of our new homeworld. And we need to gather spices for the Talaxian spice stew. I'll need rangonzo, spit basil, prishik, and some Nimian sea salt. I'm sure if you ask around, someone will have them. Of course, I'll find what you need. Isn't Chef Jolax great? He's a good friend, and his falada onion crisp is superb. We're traders. A lot of people have spices. But I bet Alex, Brexa, Wixen, and Maxon can help. I haven't seen anyone like you around here before. You must be one of those visitors from the Alpha Quadrant. How are you enjoying your time here? Uh, try the Jebelian berry salad yet? Not yet, but I'm helping your sh the, lo the chef prepare a meal to accommodate the launch. Do you have any spices? Ooh, is Jolex cooking? I can't wait. Give him this spit basil. Spice stew isn't the same without a little spit. Thank you. Maxon likes his food spicy. I once saw him add amber spice to paraca wings. Is that supposed to be anything to me, Neelix? Hi there. Are you enjoying your stay in the Delta Quadrant? Is there anything you need? I'm helping the chef prepare the meal to accommodate the launch. Give me your spices. Certainly. I have a bottle of Rengonzo from my last trading trip. I was saving it for a special occasion, and today certainly fits. Thank you. Talaxians are a warm and generous people. Ah, uh, hello, friends. <laughs> Are you looking for something? 
Spices. All I have is some Nimian sea salt. Do you need it? Give it. Now, Wixen, he's a reliable guy. You might even say he's the Nimian salt of the earth. Hello. You must be one of Neelix's friends from the Alpha Quadrant. Thank you for repairing our shield generators. Is there anything I can do to help you? Give me all your spices. My mate gave me a bit of Prishik last Rixen. Would that help? Give it. Alex is like a mother to all the children here. She always has a bit of candy in her pockets for them. Thank you so much. I'll save you a bowl of stew. Sure, I love spicy food. I need to scan the route we'll take to the colony. But the Kazon attack has damaged our astrometric system. All it will tell me is how far off I am from our target position. I feel like I'm taking shots in the dark. Would you be willing to help me? I suppose. By adjusting the sensor array's pitch, up and down, and yaw, left and right, you can point the array at the target. By adjusting the force, you can change the distance the array examines. Be sure not to overshoot the target location. The array will be useless if that happens. Adjust the pitch yawn force to get the arrival coordinates closer to target position. Target must be within one kilometer. The current distance, current arrival position is. Okay. Oop. Oh. I can't thank you enough for your help. Dex is going to be fine. The doctors say she'll be up and around in no time. Good. Glad to hear it, Neelix. I need to return to Voyager. Please escort the Talaxian fleet to New Talix. It would be an honor, Admiral. We can return to Voyager at your earliest convenience. The Talaxians have much to do. Certainly. Bet you can I can now fly you there, Tuvok. Thank you for all you have done for the Talaxians. I believe that they will be a valuable ally to us in the days ahead. That would not have been possible without your assistance. I am confident we will see one another again. Until then, live long and prosper. Peace and long life to you, Admiral. Our ships are ready to depart. Travel to the staging area to join us in our new adventure. On my way, Linux. Are you ready to depart for New Talax? Yes.
Sir, I'm detecting extremely high radiation levels of the system. Too high for normal dispersal pattern. I'll investigate further. But first, Neelix is hailing us. Are you detecting the theta radiation spikes? Those levels have been normal and steady for weeks now. What could have happened? I'll check it out. You stay with the fleet. Sir, uh, there appears to be a high amount of these theta, uh, theta radiations around the planet. Our scans indicate that it was recently placed here. It is not... I mean, it should not be an issue for us to remove them. But we should deal with whoever dumped the radiation in the first place. Neelix, you know what's going on. I'll deal with this. Shoot. Unknown vessel. This site is claimed by the Malon. Go find your own dump site. The Talaxians have claimed this system. You need to find another place to dump your waste. Why? I was here first. Besides, there's a neutron star near here that makes this the perfect location for our needs. Finding another would be too expensive. Tell the Talaxians to find another planet. You know what? Take your... This is your last chance. Leave now or I'll make you leave. Mayline of com communication, sir. They're powering the weapons. But you're not a match. But they're not a match for the Petro. Red alert. Target their engines. Destroying the ships will only make the radiation worse. Sir, sensor detecting Malon reinforcements on the intercept course. Okay. Hi. Battleship inbound.
Hello, Geneva. Welcome to the party. Find another place to dump your trash. <laughs> the Malon are gone, but the radiation is still around. Oh, what can we do? This would have been a perfect hold-up. But we can't live here if the radiation is going to infect the entire planet. The Petra can easily remove the rash. radiation. Give me a moment. I was about to ask if they wanted to help, but I guess not. so much for all of your help. You are a true friend to me and to the Thalaxian people. Your crew will always be welcome on Nutanix. And good luck in your voyages. I hope to see you again soon. It was a pleasure, Neelix. Best of luck to you and your people. Yeah, let's get out of here. Causing problems? Can't say I'm surprised. Hopefully, this won't amount to more than a minor inconvenience. If it does, we'll be ready to take action. Thanks, Admiral. What do we got here? Stuff I don't need. Whatever. There's something interesting I'd like you to look into. What is your role here, Admiral? Officially? There's a joint effort aimed at establishing a new presence in the Delta Quadrant. While I was captain of the Voyager, I learned a lot about this part of the galaxy. Command felt I'd be a valuable part of our efforts here, and I agree with them. And unf unofficially? We need to find out where things stand, especially with some of the more aggressive factions in the Quadrant. There used to be a lot of distance between Delta and our neck of the galaxy, but now... Thanks to a pair of Dyson spheres and an Iconian gateway system, the Delta Quadrant might as well be next door. I'd like to make sure we're all going to be good mates. There's something interesting. Okay, guys, I want to go ahead and end it here. I want to thank you all for watching. I'm going to uh, really go ahead and end it here. Uh, so thank you all for watching. And we will see what's up in the next episode. So until then... Take care. Have a good night.